Hello everyone, today a new finished object video and this time socks, unusual socks. Okie dokie, I'm so happy with these socks, I'm going to keep them. I have in my head that I should have not more than 25 pairs. So what would you do if you would still knit socks? What would you do with those that you've knitted or those ones that you've worn and you want a new pair? Let me know down below, I want to know your opinion. Subscribe, like and let me tell you more. Now, before I go with the with the socks, uh, you need to start with the bag, and this bag, you haven't seen it for a while. I won this bag on Instagram ages ago, and I had a project in here, and I put a biro, and you can imagine what has happened. Do you see this? So, lately, I received a beautiful pin, and it's huge, let's roll, and I was able just to cover the most kind of visible thing, and I thought the bag still has its purpose and it's beautiful and it's beautifully made. And because something like this, like being love, an accident during the life, <laughs> uh, it shouldn't kind of put on the side. I tried to wash it so you could see wrinkles on the bag. I probably should have ironed it. And this is by the like side. So it's Canadian um, bag maker and podcaster, so check the, I probably put a link down below to her shop and podcast. And uh, over here we have loads of things which are progress keepers and keychain, something that to specify what I have in the bag. And this you can buy in my shop. So now, socks, aren't they interesting? And I love them so much. Either you love them or hate them, that's, I know that. I was knitting them, I was playing with the, with the colors and I think that's kind of builds your emotional connection with the project or the thing that you're making. So I can totally understand if you'd want to click now and the thumb down. I understand that. But I have some kind of energy between it uh, and why. Now the first things I need to tell you that there is a group knitting I love down below, link straight away over that and you can see a thread swap. So you can swap with people with anything you want. I, so far, maybe I'll gather more, I was able to uh, um, swap a few minis, minis up to 60 grams and a few tees just to, you know, top it to the flat large envelope and swap with someone. And uh, Anne was amazing from Northern Ireland and she did a swap with me and she sent me minis and basically I knit everything with from those minis. And I'm knitting full of minis hat and just to show you, I have included her one mini over here. So pretty, I couldn't. Oh, this one. I couldn't put into socks. Do you see it? So nice. Oh, come on. I know. It's sock. I know. It's about socks. So I received a few. Maybe on the screen I will have something. I think I published it or definitely shared it on the group. And you can see it. And what I did with it, I divided to two equal bow balls, let's say. I know they weren't equal, for sure. There was like, I don't have such a... Um, sensitive sensitive uh, weight scale like you know for medications I had to kind of go with the flow therefore I divided it and I started knitting it and um, I went with helix method if you know, don't know what that is go check links down below there is a tutorial how to do it and then I was knitting for a bit with the yarn and when I reached for instance this section I knew, knew that I want to have it separated so it won't be like just a blimps of white and blimps of black although I'll you know, from the far and distance, you can kind of see still that it, there are kind of a blimps of black and blimps of uh, white, although it's kind of dark navy and a creamy color, but you know what I mean. Then I was knitting and adding another one to finish with this. This one was just kind of tall color. Really like it. And I joined the heel over here, was able to finish. And that little bit was uh, this yarn. Therefore, I knew it's not going to last. And I had a one, meaning that I know it's going to do this effect. And I thought, should I go with it or not? And I decided, you know, I want to, I want, want them to be all from Anne. So I joined it and I know it's kind of fun, fun element. And it is so much fun to do it. In regards ends, yes, I was weaving ends. However, I'm knitting now a blanket, so wait for my episode 94, I think, 
I'll be showing you my progress and I'm doing there a magic knot so hopefully maybe if you're interested let me know down below should I put like a one minute video how to do magic knot um, if you are interested because I watched a few on silence because while I was knitting on the blanket I was watching something on Netflix and basically I didn't want to put a voice um, on and I was just watching what the lady was doing and it was splitting all the time. Eventually I figure out what I need to do exactly and now once I precisely do that thing then it's okay. So yeah let me know down below again. I want all your suggestions and, and some bit of information too. Okay so these are for me. How did I knit them? I exactly followed my toe and then the rest as in the free tutorial link down below. Um, so yeah, toe up with afterthought heel when you cut the yarn and put the heel and that's that. All of that is plain vanilla. So nice. So thank you, thank you so much for sw uh, for swapping with me. Uh, in regards to information, I received a bit of leftovers from my friend, kind of uh, a little bit early birthday present. So I was putting them and creating a full of knees hat. So hopefully that will be soon as a finished object. I can't wait to finish the hat. Um, and then uh, I had more because five uh, minis are only five grams. So I got more. The one. Oh, the leftovers were split kind of in two parts, so I was picking one, including into my uh, blanket, and then the rest was kind of to give away. She said I can do that too, so oh, I had some leftovers to, to share. And I already sent some to one friend, and I'm gathering in this beautiful box some over here. So for instance, in a while, probably I will use one, I think I took one to the blanket, so... Um, I will have some to to you know to share. I think that's all. Let's not go longer than ten minutes. And I think that's all. I hope you enjoyed this one. See you in the next one. Subscribe, like, and I think the next one could be tomorrow. More about socks. Bye. Thank you, Anne.